I think we just got to continue to get better every week. You look at uh, from week one to where we're at now, we've got we've made improvement every week. And, th and that's our focus every week is just improve on the things that uh, when we watch film, figure out what we need to improve on. We need to figure out how to start the game fast. Uh, the last two weeks, we've, we've kind of came out of the, the gates a little slow and we, we kind of figured it out as the game went on. Any any game that Lowell and Holbert plays is a team that makes the fewest mistakes and, and eliminates turnovers in, in, in what they do. You know, I expect there to be a, to be a tough matchup and, and I think that anybody that's coming out to the game or anybody that you know, hears about Lowell and Holbert playing, that they're not going to expect anything but that. Well, I think that you look at, at our team, and, and obviously Trey, Trey is uh, an outstanding running back. Quarterback Noah Ehrlich obviously is, is, is a top quarterback in the state. Noah Miller's been playing really good on the defensive line, so they've gotten better every week as well. Uh, Lowell's going to be Lowell. I mean, I think that we've, we've seen Lowell uh, so many times in, in our program history here. Uh, we know what we're getting with Lowell. They're, they're a well-coached team. Um, I respect Keith and his staff a lot. I uh, respect what they do. They're going to come in, they're going to be disciplined, uh, and, and they're going to be physical. Uh, you look at our schools, we're, we're, we're very identical in, in, our, in our, what we do and kind of what we prioritize as far as discipline and toughness. So you, you know you're going to get that every year, year in and year out with them. I mean, obviously we're playing at home. It's our senior night, so I mean, you know, hopefully we have a little bit of that motivation there. But, it, you know, our kids understand that this starts championship football and every game from this point forward is for a number on the board. So first four weeks was getting us to this point. And, uh, you know, you know, our kids understand that. They understand what they got to do. And, you know, hopefully we can come out and give our best effort. You know, us and Hobart, we're kind of in the same boat. We're replacing a good senior class and, and we have a couple skilled guys in, in certain positions that will help out. But, you know, who's gained more experience over the last four weeks is, is going to tell, you know, who's going to win this ball game. You know, you have our, our quarterback, Riley Bank, who's returning starter from last year, rushed for over a thousand yards and passed for around 600. He's the leader of our offense and, and defensively, James Langan, you know, he's, he's a returning starter at defensive end and, and he's a force to uh, be reckoned with. You know, those we, we kind of live and die by those two guys leadership wise and, and expect to have great production on the field for us to be successful. We're going to have to find a way to stop Ehrlich and Gibson on defense. Offensively, we're going to have to move the ball. We're going to have to control the clock. We're going to have to play keep away. And, and you know, it's just going to come down to not making mistakes and not having negative yardage plays and, and giving us a chance to win the ball game at the end. <laughs> 